a campaign to get the city of Rochester to divest from Chase Bank, um, a bank that is that is has a horrendous history with uh, with people's mortgages, kicking people out, uh, not modifying mortgages that people are in a hard hard position to pay, and not even talking with them about modifying them. They've got one of the lowest rates of mortgage modification uh, uh, in the state, and our city is helping them profit in the millions, right? Just by using them as the bank that we hold our money in. Because banks make money off the interest and the and the and of the of the money in your savings, right? So that that's a very key way that on one hand, Chase profits from our city money and our tax revenue, and on the other hand, kicks people out in our city, makes more abandoned houses, drives down property value, um, and increases and increases homelessness. So those two things don't make sense to us. We're going to give Chase a chance. We're going to go to their corporate offices downtown this Friday at 12:30. We're going to give them a letter saying, you know, there's a handful of things you can do. Start negotiating with people on modifying their mortgages. Reduce the the principal on some of those mortgages that are just obscene. The, the houses that were way too expensive in the first place, and you knew were not valued that much. And if you do those things, we won't push for Rochester to die back. Now we don't expect they're going to do that, so we expect we're still going to have to push Rochester to die best. But we got to give Chase a chance. So we're going to be down there Friday to do that. We hope all of you will join us. We'd love to have a delegation of like 70 people go in to deliver that letter so they know how serious we are. Uh, if you have any questions about that, just talk to me afterwards. <laughs> Somebody. Oh, okay.